Right, right now our sports team is out enjoying some golf. They were allowed to go out and do that. It was all for a good cause. Yeah, and Jenny Hansen joined Adam and AJ on the course in the Bald Face Truth Charity Golf Tournament today out at the reserve. AJ joins us live now. How did you do today, AJ? You know, um, I'm not going to quit my day job. You guys are stuck with me for a little bit longer. The LPGA will not be calling me up anytime soon, but I did not embarrass the coin name, which is very important, but most importantly, it is a great cause out here. And like you mentioned, Adam, Jenny, and I all out here contributing to that cause. Also, the Civil War tendencies put aside, both the Ducks and Beavers, new baseball coaches out here supporting the Bald Face Truth Foundation. And John Canzano explains to us exactly what the this tournament is for and how it gives back to the kids in our community. There's so much that we do that doesn't matter, right? You know, we talk sports or whatever, that doesn't really matter. What matters is there's so many kids in our state, in our communities that really need help. They need to participate in sports, they need to participate in band and drama, after school programs, and this event is one of our two fundraisers for the year. This funds the summer camp that, that is for special needs kids, so everybody out here is doing good things. Well, it's an outstanding job that John uh, Gonzano does and all the people that work with him to do something for the young people of our state and surrounding territory. I've tried to do my best to help John and a number of other people, and this is just a wonderful affair, to everybody getting together and having a wonderful time. You just said you don't know if the smile's ever going to leave your face. Has it been a, just a dream come true? It really has. Um, exciting for myself, our family. Um, my dad lives down here in Lebanon, and the kids are excited to see Grandpa. Grandpa's excited to see the kids. But it's just been, ever since stepping on campus, um, this place has always been home. It certainly has been, and like you, we've talked about a little bit, right, both the Beavers and Ducks head baseball coaches doing a little bit of coming home. So I caught up with Mark Wazikowski as well, and he said that the recruiting trail has not stopped for both the Ducks baseball and the Beavers baseball. He said he saw Oregon State's assistant coaches out recruiting this morning with his assistant coaches before they hit the links this afternoon. And I haven't heard if they've actually met on the course, but they said before, uh, Mark told me before this whole tournament kicked off that they haven't done a lot of talking. The rivalry is on, but of course, putting it aside for a great cause today. So it's been a blast. Perfect weather. I just got to work on my golf game a little bit, you guys. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it sounds like uh, you guys, the coin team and the coaches all hard at work today, but yeah, having fun for a good cause. Thanks, AJ. Yeah, look how beautiful it is out there. Steve joined